welcome to this video on how to view and use the Query Weights. The Query Weights tab allows you to analyze weights over time in two different views. The Query Weights over time and the Query Weights by duration. This will allow you to better determine where your biggest bottleneck are occurring and what changes could potentially have the biggest performance boost in your SQL Server instance. The chart includes each of the following weight type categories. Backup, I.O., Lock, Memory, Non-I.O. Page Latch, Non-Page Latch, Transaction Log, and others. The first view would be Query Weights over time. Under Queries and Query Weights, you can see what types of queries you have in your SQL Server in real time or historical time. You will see the weight categories along with the time frame on the bottom. On the y-axis, you will see the total wait time in milliseconds. My preferred way of doing this is by selecting the query weights by duration. Switching the view here allows you to see a different representation of the weights, this time by duration. I can approach this in a few ways. One is by drilling down from the biggest weight offender to understand what statements from what applications, what databases, users, and sessions this is coming from. The second approach will be from an application standpoint. Let's say a user will call me and they say a particular application is slow. I can narrow down all the categories, statements, databases, and users that are only being used by that application. Drilling down allows me to see the weight category, the statement, that I can right-click and see the complete SQL statement and copy that to the clipboard. Going further, I can see the database, clients, sessions, and user affecting this weight. Thank you, and for more information, visit idera.com.